I know especially with how last episode ended, this episode is gonna be pretty fucking insane. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's E-Boy Darius back at it again with Don Machi, episode 8 called Argonaut. Not a single clue what that means. Last episode, we had some training from Eyes. We ran into Hestia, Bestia again. Uh, we had some great dialogue between Hestia and Lily, and then Lily and um, Bell, you know, just working on their relationship, developing more, all that. Got some good training with Eyes. I'm excited for that. But the way it ended was pretty pretty scary i won't lie i'm pretty sure the guy otaro the kianthrope that was training that minotaur i'm pretty sure that's otaro i'm just guessing that because freya wanted to leave something in his hands and that's the only suspicious character we saw throughout that whole episode so i'm gonna assume that for now but i'm gonna hop into this right now remember guys if you guys want early access and full length to this episode and this show all the other shows i'm watching consider checking out that patreon down below if you guys want to support me and patreon's not really your thing if you guys could just leave a like and a nice comment down below it helps push me out there into the youtube algorithm it means a lot trust me trust me trust me let's hop into this don't forget to follow me on twitch and on twitter let's hop into this don machi episode eight I like how I assumed that's Otaro and it literally shows that <laughs> while Otaro's talking. I assume. She is rather strong. Which... Which we're practicing against someone very difficult. And I said last episode we could get a... It's a valid point. We can get a huge amount of XP from this. Okay. You are at your core. I understand that. When you think about it like that, in simple terms, it makes a whole lot of sense. I wonder what Seer's thinking. Some more great training. Oh, again, another expectation subversion. It made it look like she was looking like oh, she was about to be taken back, but nope. <laughs> She's just that nasty. Good. So he had the ability, the option, opportunity. They're about to go on their expedition. Well, you have to do it anyway. I respect it. Oh, this is definitely the Loki familia. I recognize the two babes right there. Of course, Riveria eyes. We have help from other- Wow, this is a huge expedition. The 50th? 59th. They've never gone down to the 59th. I'm sorry. I haven't played too many dungeon type games, so for reference for myself, and this is might seem childish or idiotic to some of you, but I just am basing this off of the, the the few dungeon games i have played like binding of isaac a fantastic one uh the pokemon adventure dungeon games um adventure bit what are those fucking called you guys know what i'm trying to say those are very similar to this where it's like floors you know the deeper you go like i can picture going to floor like 50 to 59 on sky tower that'd be almost you know, that'd be fucking insane so like it's just crazy how how fucking cool this is like a video game you know Ahead of schedule, open the box. Greedy, that is Otaro. She has such a nice ass. Child show. I'm so curious. Oh my lordy. Hmm. Oh, is that another day they were on an expedition? Hmm. I was gonna say maybe we'll run into another Minotaur, but I completely forgot. I don't know how the Minotaur that is an important Minotaur, like the important Minotaur. Not and see a Minotaur on this floor would be crazy, but not even this is the ninth, not even the tenth, so we're not even lower. But this is a an even stronger Minotaur. But with how Bell just had his new resolve, how he wants to catch up no matter the cost, he's gonna fight this. Whereas last time, mm-hmm. 
And it's the exact same monster that I saved him from. It's so poetic. He needs to fight it. He's going to try to use himself as bait. Get his attention. Ooh, that was close. Oh my lord. Armor is taking a beating to a pulp already. No hesitation. I love that. She genuinely really likes him. Man, I love Eyes is so cool. She's such a cool girl. Hey, less armor we have. That was the thing Eyes told him last episode. Less armor he has, though, the more agile he should be. Oh my god, my boy is putting in work. This Minotaur is insanely strong. Yeah, I would be telling her the same thing. You have to. This is not looking good right now. Come on, Lily. Maybe you can go find some help. Atta girl. She feels so bad about leaving him again. It's a good point. You have to. You're not a coward, but you are, but you're not. You have to be adventurous. You gotta catch up to eyes. Yeah, I'm telling you, speed is insane. Buy time. That's a good plan. I like it. Buying time is a good strategy, but in a battle of attrition, you'll lose guaranteed. We're going to need to find a counterattack. Oh, no. With the horn? Oh, my God. We only have the Hestia knife now. I do feel bad for his mental that she has to protect him again, but I'm so glad she's here to protect him. You see? I knew it would be bad for his mental. I knew it would. It'll just, it'll just really solidify in his mind that he will never be able to catch up, which is his mission right now. Oh, and these are the guys, some of the guys who were laughing at him last time. He's going to prove himself right now. Bell is about to be the biggest man. Babe, I got this. Move out the way. I got this. It's okay, honey. This man's about to go ham right here. Mr. Bell Cronell. Oh, he's like, something's different about him. <laughs> he has a different vibe. <laughs> I love animes when they fucking do that. Oh, something's changed. His resolve. We got everyone watching. Oh, we literally have some of the strongest people that we can have watching, watching, and I'm so happy about this. I hope everything works out. I'm praying. I can't not hear Bakugo <laughs> hearing this guy. Bete, yeah. Look at nice little Reveria. Yes, heal her. Now he feels bad, come on. Ah, he feels bad. Okay, bet. Oh. She's like, no, let my man handle this. Hold up there, Bete. Get some good little cuss up in there. Oh, God, is this fucking dope. Oh my god. The Argonaut. It's a story of a boy who wants to be a hero. The Firebolt is such a cool addition into his fucking armory. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh, that was clean. That was clean. Oh my lord. Get that arm the fuck out of here. That shit is done for. Animation and then he even picked up the Berserker Blade, bro. This shit is... 
That's what I'm telling you, bro. This show has the perfect mix of waifus, comedy, action, fantasy elements, waifus. Like, come on. Good dodge. Ooh, he went under right into the neck or right in the chest. I knew it was going to be vital. Or the gut. Wherever he fucking stabbed him. Oh, he stabbed him and then firebolted in his belly. Oh my god, he's roasted. That was fucking... Talk about strategy, right? That's what we were talking about earlier. That's a good strategy. What he was lacking. <laughs> that was so cool. Oh my god, could there be anything that looks cooler than that? Come on. Mine zero, bro. What the fuck? Is that the reward he gets? Like a crystallized minotaur horn? Yeah, definitely don't do that. <laughs> right? I'd be like, bro, what level am I? Come on, check that shit. <laughs> oh. Bell Cronell. <laughs> that's my boy. Uh Yeah, to think that's how we started. Asking around, couldn't even make it anywhere. Level one, noob, doing what we can, just the two of us. How far are we come in a matter of eight episodes, you know? It's crazy. Hell yeah. Oh, bruh, that episode was dope. That episode was amazing. Oh my lord, it was so singular. It was literally pretty much the entire episode was that fight. It felt like it was five minutes long, that entire episode. That's how fast it went. Like one, first off, that whole dungeon going down as a big group with some of the strongest people getting assistance from other parties, Familia, stuff like that. If you guys heard that, that was the last episode rendering. To go down to an unexplored area is so genius, it's so cool, and I would love to have seen that for sure, but the way they kind of cut that off, canceled that, was that they couldn't even make it down to where they were going to meet up is because, you know, this Minotaur is on the floor, it wasn't supposed to be. And for Bell to be so smart about getting Lily out of there, you know, him needing to be saved again, but then manning up and then, oh, just overcoming all that was just so well done. I really did not write down a single thing this episode. God damn, that was so good. And I'm so glad. I would have been content so much with just uh, Eyes and Lily being there. But Beite, R Riveria, the everyone else. Everyone everyone who was there making fun of him that day. Just got all abilities rank S. Are you shitting me? It was it was episode four. It was four episodes ago, episodes ago that he just got some of his abilities to rank E. Like they were fucking F before and they got him to E. And now he's already at S at some of them. Like... Let's keep training with eyes for a little bit longer. Let's do a couple of more of those. Oh my lord. The animation on that fight, insane. The strategy, insane. They were like, it's hard to, to pierce his flesh. We had to use our speed to make up for it. We had to get one good piercing in there. And then boom, fireball, fireball. We're roasting from the inside. Just genius. Jesus. So good. So good. If you guys enjoyed and want to rewatch that in the full length, feel free to check out that Patreon. That was so good. Otherwise, maybe I'll see you guys in this next episode. I'm about to go watch it. Peace out, y'all. That was fucking nuts.